I've coached in a lot of places in my career, but my first time in Connecticut, it's different from any state I've ever coached in before. The way the arena is built, fans are right on you, so you don't feel like they're removed. They make a difference in the outcome of a game. It's the best place in the WNBA to play and the best place in the WNBA to coach. The first game with the Sun is super exciting. You know, this isn't a team that's looking to prove anything. They are one of the best teams in the league. They've established that. You know, I'm just eager to be a part of that next step. To see fire from a player, you can look in her eye and you can see that she is not gonna lose. You're gonna have to go through her and it does not change based on the score or the time or what's happening in a game. Our job is to discover that fire. There's some bit of wonder, is it gonna be enough? Is all the blood, sweat, and tears that we do this year gonna be enough? Is it gonna get us over the hurdle? And it's one more opportunity for them to step into greatness. It's a different kind of family than your own personal family. And that means there's a lot of diversity, there's a lot of different personalities, a lot of different backgrounds, but generally they have to work together. Through that, we learn your strengths and your weaknesses and as a team how we can play to your strengths and maybe cover your weaknesses. So developing that rapport and that relationship, that background with players develops a trust that enables me to be hard on them um, and hopefully enables them to give me everything they've got. Well, I'm a woman of few words generally come game time is for players to shine and the vision we have for this team we really share it. So uh, I, I am thrilled. Every day I love coming to work. I'm going to be me. I'm going to speak concisely what our goals are and then make sure everybody's ready, motivated, and prepared to go out and get the job done.